Our bodies are uh, constantly exposed to free radicals as a consequence of metabolism and things in our environment. I love to be in the sun. I love to swim. Even though I wear sunscreen, I know the sun can be damaging. If you're exposed too often and too long to these things, then uh, things can go wrong. The more shots on goal you have, the more problems you ultimately have. Sooner or later, uh, free radicals are going to score. I know fast food's bad for me, but it tastes good and it's easy. To neutralize free radicals, we need uh, what we call antioxidants. Antioxidants destroy free radicals. I don't smoke, but I know quite a few people who do, so it's, it's kind of hard to avoid. I also live and work in a city, so I'm constantly around smoke, exhaust, and, you know, other pollution, even, even when I'm just walking down the street. It's well known that antioxidants are essential to maintain the right balance uh, in your life uh, for health. Exposure to free radical activity is a natural part of life. However, in today's highly stressful and hectic world, it's possible to become overexposed and experience the consequences of free radical damage. Even breathing puts free radicals in your body. Environmental pollution, unbalanced diets, foods that contain preservatives and additives, insufficient physical exercise, and even mental stress all may contribute to free radical damage. When left unchecked, free radical damage to your cells accumulates and can lead to health concerns later in life. As a matter of fact, free radical damage is one of the main causes of premature aging and is a large factor in the deterioration of health over time. Free radicals are harmful oxygen molecules, often called scavengers, that try to steal electrons from other molecules. This action causes damage to the cell's DNA. A good example of free radical damage is an apple that has been exposed to the air. The half that doesn't have any protection turns brown, which indicates free radical damage and which ultimately causes the apple to decay. However, when you cover the exposed area of the apple with lemon juice, it doesn't turn brown. This is a simple demonstration that helps show how antioxidants protect the exposed surface of the apple from free radical damage. The human body combats free radical damage by producing antioxidants naturally. These stable molecules mop up free radicals to prevent cellular damage. Although the body produces some antioxidants, it relies on dietary sources for the rest. Unfortunately, some people simply do not eat enough foods that are high in antioxidants. So what is the solution? What should people do to protect themselves? <laughs> 